how far are you willing to take extreme self-care? Are you willing to put slime, like snail slime on your face to look better? I, I don't know that I can do it. <laughs> John has no idea what's on my face. So I'm gonna have him come out here in a minute and I'm gonna, we're gonna catch his reaction when I tell him that I put snail slime on my face. He has no idea. And this is self-care September. For me, this is extreme self-care. John may never kiss my face again. It has no smell. We're gonna talk about a product called Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence. It's by, now I'm, I'm not familiar with this brand, it's the, I'm gonna put my reading glasses on. Um, uh, C-O-S-R-X, Coser, Cosix, Cosix or something like that, C-O-S-R-X. I'm not even going, I did get it on Amazon. I, if, if you're interested in the product, just Google it. I don't know if I'm gonna put a link in it. I do sometimes have affiliate links, but this is not a product I'm telling you to buy. Like, I want you to know that this is me trying something new and being an, under the influence. I'm under the influence of a really good friend of mine um, my, my, that I have over all the time. She's a very good friend of mine. She recommended it and her, and then my favorite people on YouTube have been talking about it. I'm under the influence. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and Google snail mucin. And this is what pops up, and there's a lot of sponsored here. Ulta Beauty sells it, Amazon, Pennies. I mean, it's all over the place. It is, I had never heard of it, but I'm not really a guru when it comes to beauty and such things like skincare. Um, CNN has an article, Your Guide to Snail Mucin Skincare 14 Products. It's designed for protection and healing. As you can see, there is a lot of information out on this product. So, New York Magazine, WebMD. We'll just click here real quick. Now, some re researchers think that snail mu uh, mucus, that's what it is. It's the slime left behind snails when they're going across the surface. It promises, uh, it shows promise at hydrating skin, improving fine lines, and helping wounds and scratches heal faster. Others say that more research is needed. I'm not here as an influencer. I'm here as being under the influence. <laughs> And my, John does not even know I ordered this. I ordered it from Amazon and I got a reminder the other day from my Echo device. And she's like, reminder, your, uh, and she said your, um, she said your snail mucin will arrive before 10 p.m. John was sitting right next to me. I thought for sure he was gonna say something. John does not even, I don't know if he was just in his head, in his own thoughts, because he's got a lot on his mind with work. Oh, have you guys heard of snail mucin? <laughs> now guys, this isn't just for women, I don't think. I mean, I think, I think you guys can use it too. And I heard a story that the reason this became so popular is because they, whoever they are, some at some point people noticed that snail farmers, their hands were healing from like their hands were looked younger and their their algaes, you know, healed faster if they had an algae on their hand. My friend swears by it. A lot of YouTubers swear by it. It's all over TikTok. And it's basically the slime that comes from snails. <laughs> like the, like, you know, as a snail kind of, you leave that little trail of slime behind, it's like, ugh. Uh. So, I'm basically gonna put that on my face today. Oh, and I don't know if I'm gonna continue to use it. I spent about $14 on this 3.8 foot ounces. And um, I'm gonna try it. I'm adventuresome. And this is self-care September. It's all about me taking really good care of myself and going to the extreme. And I would say this is, uh, for me, this is extreme self-care. 
I'm gonna put snail slime on my face. Okay, put a little bit on my hand. It is slimy. Okay. Okay, um, I don't know where to start. I guess I'll start on my forehead. <laughs> I'm just gonna pat it in, and I'm just, I'm just putting a all oh, glory, lordy, lordy. All right, thank goodness it has no smell. Like, there's no smell. <laughs> oh, Lord. You know, God provides, right? <laughs> oh, Lord. <sighs> okay. I can do this. I think I'd rather hunt real ghosts. I am referring to a game that I've been playing with my son and my husband where you hunt ghosts in a video game, but I cut that part out because this video would have been way too long. It is, it's a little weird going on. And they say a little bit goes a long way. So this bottle should really last me a long time. If I decide, especially if, if I don't use it, it'll last me a super long time. If I don't use it, I'm gonna give it to my friend. Okay, let me get my upper lip. Because I have lip lines and like this is really, if I could make a, oh God, not too close to my mouth. <sighs> okay. All right, guys, I've been slimed. I've been slimed. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna put a little bit on the tops of my hands too. All right, ladies, you skincare gals, beauty, let me know what you think. Like, I want your honest opinion, like seriously. Um, I'm really looking at the extremes that we go to. Like for me as an older woman, <laughs> oh, oh. Let me go wash my hands. Okay. All right. My, right up here, um, I've had it on just a few minutes. I went and washed my hands and I'm starting to itch right up here, which that's what happens to me with certain things. I'll start itching. I am noticing a little itching up there. And this is all I have on. We'll see what happens. I mean, if it irritates my skin, then it's a definitely a no. I don't need anything else irritating my skin. I don't know whether to put a little more up there or I don't know what to, it is itching a little bit. But anyway, I'd love your uh, honest opinion about snail slime. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm just really not sure. But I did wanna try it. And I know obviously it's something you've got to use over time. One time is not gonna help. Now, from what I understand, you put it on and you'll start, like, your face will feel a little bit tight, which I, it, it is feeling a little bit tight. Not much, not bad, just a little bit. Uh, but I'm going to leave it on today, and I don't think I'm going to put, I don't think I'm going to put anything else on for a little while, no makeup or anything, uh, and I'm just going to go get my workout in. Uh, I'm going to get a few things done around the house, and... Um, I'll keep you guys posted on. John is putting some of these. What are those, John? Cream cheese, jalapeno these are poppers. Jalapeno poppers. We just bought them at Sam's Club. We're going to grill them on the Trigger Grill mm -hmm. uh, with dinner tonight. I think basically I'm going to eat those and a salad for my dinner, I think. Mm -hmm. And then put a uh, boomerang pot pie in the oven for you. Yep. I don't know. I'm Who am I kidding? I, I might have to have some boomerang popcorn. Uh, <laughs> Uh, not popcorn. Popcorn sounds good too. Yeah. Uh, boomerang uh, pot pie, chicken pot pie. We like those. Mm -hmm. All right, John's gonna put those on the grill. So, uh, what's the temp, John? 425. 425 for how long? I think 15 minutes. Yeah, 15 minutes. Yum. All right, so it is dinner time and. Uh, so we're, we're doing those um, bacon wraps on the grill and I have a toaster oven I keep out on the back porch. That way we have to, when we cook things like this, I don't have to turn on the oven because it gets hot. Uh, even though we have the air is keeping it nice and cool uh, in the house, 
it's nice to have just something out there. So uh, these, these are the boomerangs. And they're, they're just really, really easy. And these are, you know, for fat, for quick food, they're, they're not terrible. So uh, I'm just gonna put a couple of these in the, um, the toaster oven. Okay, I'm just gonna put these on 400 degrees for um, 40 minutes. And I'm putting aluminum underneath them just so that they, I should have gotten a pan, but I'm just, <laughs> you're gonna see a lot of simple stuff around my place because some days I just don't really wanna go. To, I cook for a big family for a lot of years. So I'm simplifying my life. I do like to cook sometimes, but I do need to bump this up because I only put it on, let's see, I put it on, um, oops, and we're gonna do a uh, timer, uh, 40 minutes. And in the toaster oven, and you know what, I just have to say too, some of these, um, let me just sit here for a second. So uh, some of the directions when you look at these, um, like we like Boomerang and we also like Blake's chicken pot pies. They're, they're all chicken, that's the only one we really get. Is uh, um, We like them all, but it's like the, um, the one we really like is, I think the Boomerang even better than Blake's chicken pot pies and uh, and then when you look at the directions to cook them, sometimes it'll tell you don't cook them in the toaster oven, but I've been cooking mine in the toaster oven forever, and I do, um, I have, and when I first started off, I always check the temperature to make sure that the center of the pot pie was cooked enough, but it always has been, so. Um, okay, so my face is, I've had that slime on all day, and the itching went away right away, and I, don't, I have not put anything else on my face. John has no idea what's on my face. So I'm gonna have him come out here in a minute, and I'm gonna, we're gonna catch his reaction when I tell him that I put snail slime on my face. He has no idea. He has no idea. I just told him, I asked him if he'd be willing to be on my uh, video for just a few minutes, I wanted to run something by him and he said, yeah, okay, that's fine. <laughs> Cause he's not always like, he doesn't always want to be on camera. So he did have a dentist appointment today, which was fine. Cause um, they did say he's going to have to get another, uh, a crown like redone or something. But today he just had a cleaning. So, so he can have all the food, but we're going to catch his reaction to the snail slime in a bit. We'll see what he says. See if he's willing to kiss me on after uh, you know after I tell him what I put on my face today. I do want to just say he's the one that eats all. I mean, he's like he'll eat frog legs and he hunts and he eats all kinds of stuff. Like when we were dating, he used to get extra onions on his hamburger when we went out on a date. Yeah, he put gum in his mouth, but uh, afterwards, but he always ordered extra onions on his hamburger, which I always thought was kind of weird because we were just dating. We hardly knew each other. And I thought, well, he must not like me that much because he's having extra onions on his hamburger. Um, you wouldn't do that if you're trying to impress a date, right? Like, let me know what you think. But honestly, we've been married now for, oh my goodness, how long have we been married? 35 years? It'll be 35 years next in a couple of months. So. Here, honey, come have a seat. So um, we have three minutes until our bacon wraps are done. Have a seat. Okay. Do you want to sit on this side? It's okay. I'm sitting here. Okay. <laughs> He's complaining of the cat, our outdoor. Well, kind of is our outdoor cat. Our visitor cat. Yeah, but it's not our cat, but it's a neighborhood cat. But I mm -hmm. feed it, and it comes here mm -hmm. and uh, sleeps on our sofa. Yep. So, all right, so um, have a sip of wine. Okay. So what do you think about, um, well, I'll just, so when we went to the game with our friends, the Bronco game. Yeah. And our friend, let's just call her Susan. 
Okay. She told me that there's this really cool thing that her daughter told her about yeah. to use on our skin. Okay. And it's very inexpensive. It was only $14. I ordered some from Amazon. Okay. And I put some on today. Okay. And I thought, I wanted to see what you thought about this product. So let me know. What do you think? It's all I have on today. I mean, I've only had it on for a day, so it's not, you're not gonna really notice any difference. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, it's not gross or anything, right? I, I don't see any, anything different. Well, honey, I wanna tell you what it is. Well, before you touch me, <laughs> let me know what it is. <laughs> uh, it's not bad. Just no, come here, I wanna just... hear it first. <laughs> it's probably something gross. Okay, so it's a Korean thing. Ah, you know, we have okay. a family member that lives in yeah, Korea. Yeah, and who and, knows? And you know, so, okay. So it is snail slime. Ah. It's actually called the snail mucin. Oh, when we were okay. sitting there the other night, last night when, when the delivery came in, uh -huh. our little uh, Alexa app said, mm -hmm. your delivery came yeah. in and she said snail mucin and I, I looked, oh. I was wondering if you were going to react. I have no idea what that is, but you don't know snail what, slime. You don't know what it is? No, you just told well, me it said it's snail slime, so. Okay, so now you know what it is. Now I know what it is. <laughs> so do you want to kiss me? Mm. No, I think I'll pass. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's got really good, like, it's supposed to have be really good for our okay. skin. So, and no sna snails were injured. Oh, as long as it's all cleaned off when you touch me. I mean, that seems like snail poop to me. Well, I'm going to put it on before I go to bed at Ooh, night. Oh, okay. Well, make sure you put a sack over your head. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, what do you think of it? It's kind of weird, huh? I mean, it's strange, but I don't know. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Okay. Okay. I'm, All right. Our alarm's going off. His alarm's going off. Okay. For our jalapeno poppers. You were way too calm and collected. I was hoping to get like a really dramatic, grossy kind of look on your face, but you're just. This is how. He, this is why you're the boss. No, I've dealt with a lot more weird, slimy stuff than snail poop. Yeah, it's snail slime. <laughs> it's actually called snail mutin. Okay. It's this, the stuff they leave behind when nice. they... Do you want to know how they get it? I don't really care. Okay. <laughs> okay, timer's going off. All I right. want to ruin our food. Go get dinner. Wow. Well, did you hear what he said? Wow, that's weird. He, did, he didn't see that coming. He did not see that coming. Oh, that was anticlimactic. I really thought he was going to have a, a more fun reaction to that, but he deals with stuff all day at work, so I don't know. It was kind of boring, but honestly, so I put the stuff on this morning. It, it felt good. I mean, and I keep, and I look at myself in the mirror and I think, I do think it, I, I do feel like it, it It looks okay. Like, I'm gonna look at my face and I will go, well, it feels good, my face feels good. But I can't get beyond what it is. So honestly, I don't think I'm gonna use it. Uh, I just don't think I'm gonna use it. Uh, I'm probably just gonna give the bottle to my friend uh, but I don't know yet. Let me know what you guys think, though. How far are you willing to take extreme self-care? Are you willing to put slime, like snail slime, on your face to look better? I, I don't know that I can do it. <laughs> so there you have it. <laughs> I just don't know if I can do it. All right, guys, we're going to have dinner. I want to thank you for hanging out with me. Let me know what you think about snail slime. And what do you think I what do you think my theme should be in October? I want to come up with a theme for October. I really enjoyed uh, doing a self-care September. We're not done yet. I still have more videos, but I am thinking ahead. What do you guys think? Should I have a theme for November or October? And give me some suggestions. Let me know what you think about the snail stuff. And 
I'll see you on the next one. Let's have a drink, just relax, all your problems will fade. If you're ready for a good time, count on me. There's a party in the backyard, dance your problems away. I'm all about the good vibes, I know you're all about the good vibes. Do you know how much I love We're done here. <laughs>